Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video on the Super Squad channel where today we're here in NASCAR E3 for the Championship Mode Series. 34th race of the season, after this there's only two more. And without further ado, let's get into this. Let's go qualifying because we're not going to practice, we don't need it. Alright, so let's take a look at the paint scheme. I had to make it myself again because no one made a suggestion for paint scheme, so... Uh, you cannot suggest paint schemes anymore because someone has already taken ISM like a long time ago. That is Chevrolet Cup Series who's taken it. And Ray Ray Craze has taken Homestead. Uh, you guys will see what the paint schemes are in each episode. But they have taken those already so that's it. No more paint scheme. Oh well yeah. Here's this paint scheme. So uh, I can't really show you guys now but uh, I tried to make it look like the NASCAR logo like it's all NASCAR color themed with the black yellow red and blue and a little bit of white right there and yeah so we got Can-Am on the hood Ream on the back flex seal on the sides getting a really bad qualifying lap because I'm trying to show the paint scheme uh, I forgot what's on the deck lid deck lid is Allegant and Thrustmaster on the side. Oh, yep, yeah, this is going to be a bad qualifying session. <clears throat> and we are in a Toyota, number 99. Hopefully we can get ourselves a win and advance ourselves to Homestead. Because if we have bad for performances, there's still a chance we could get eliminated. We have a lot of points, but we need to make sure we get in. <clears throat> so Brad Keselowski on the pole. We qualify 15th, that's not bad, uh, seeing as how bad I did in qualifying. I think Kurt Busch is starting the worst of all the people who can compete for a championship. So, now I'm just disconnecting my controller really quick because I had it charging. And let's start the race. The Texas 500, or Triple A Texas 500. Ricky Stenhouse hasn't been as fast as expected. Jimmy Johnson crashed during qualifying, he will be driving a backup car. And there is us. <coughs> we won Texas earlier this year. It was our first win of the season. Let's see if we can get another win here at Texas. Denny Hamlin's also back here. Amarola was looking to take the position away from me, but he couldn't. And we're going to try and get underneath Blaney right here. And we're going to drive it into turn three. Make it stick. Bowman's in front of us. We're going to get underneath him. There's Chase Elliott. We got sideways. I think Chase Elliott won last episode, right? Pretty sure. Or no, it was Kurt. Okay, so Kurt's advanced. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Save it. Oh, we saved it. Oh, Amarola didn't, though. All right, so Kurt is locked in. He doesn't have any worries. Amarola goes around. Caution comes out. We fall back to 14th because of that. All right. <laughs> so, Kurt, if you could move out the way, that'd be very much appreciated. Gonna try and take it three wide. Car there on the inside. And we'll complete the pass there as we got some more momentum, but Blaney put us in the wall a little bit. And full throttle turns three and four. Three wide with Chase and Bowman. We're gonna make the pass. P7 looking for P6. Oh, Menard. Okay. I think I hit him a little bit, but not that bad. All right, made up a lot of track position. I don't know where to go. I stalled right there. <coughs> All right. Working on Truex for third. We're going to make the pass. 
And now we're going to work on Kyle Bush for a second, taking the high side. Try and get a run off the corner. We're going to dive it underneath him. And Brad Keselowski isn't in the playoffs. He was eliminated, but he is leading the race. All right. See if we can grab first from Keselowski. 13 laps left in the stage. Oh, whoa! We got really loose. I bumped Keselowski a little bit, and we got really, I don't know, loose or tight. Like, I got loose when I hit him, but then I just shot up the track. Oh, my gosh, we lost lots of track position right there. Luckily, we only fell to third, and we just got second back just now from Kyle Busch. In front of this car actually looks pretty cool. A black Toyota? That actually looks nice. With the Can-Am on the hood. I actually really like this paint scheme. Like, I'm the paint scheme master in this game. Like, look at this. Anyways, here we are working on Keselowski as we get a little bit tight. Drove it in really deep. Gonna try and get to the outside of Brad Keselowski. We're not gonna get there just yet. I tried, but all I did was give him a bump. Oh, I tried to slide it in there, but I couldn't. Oh, can we get the crossover? Nope, we just stalled right there. And maybe now we're going to slide it in. We drift up the track a little bit, make contact with Brad, but we're still good. This race is entertaining. Wow. Tend to go on the stage. Oh no, got loose. I hit the apron and we're gonna save it. I'm gonna let Kyle Bush go so I don't hold him up. Oh, I almost hit him too. All right, we're gonna get right back around Kyle Bush on the outside, or will we? No, not yet. I thought we were going to as we hit the wall on the front stretch. Alright, we've fallen back quite a bit. We get a big run on Kyle Busch. I'm gonna go to the high side in turn three. We're not gonna be clear yet. As we make contact and we wreck on the front stretch. Caution's out. P3. Wait, what's the point of pitting? Oh, nine laps to go on the stage. Okay. One cannon right sides, I guess. We'll make these adjustments now. Uh, I guess, because that's what they're probably going to do too. Oh, never mind. I'll gain some track position from that. I was just trying to stay third, but I'm gaining track position from that, so I'll take it. going to have to pit for more, though, after the stage. Let's see if we can win it. Oh, we drift up the track. How old are our... Uh, we might be in some trouble because I felt the car get pretty loose. And that's what happens when tires are old in this game. Yeah, I have a feeling I might go around. But we got clean air and track position in first. As long as we can... Oh, yep, I'm getting really loose. As long as we can hold on to it, we should be fine. Got to work the throttle a little bit more so I don't spin it out. If you hear me getting out the throttle, it's because I'm trying to not spin out. Oh my gosh. I'm surprised they're not catching up. 
All right. Hit the wall a little bit there. And to turn three, we get a little bit tight. I didn't arc it into the angle right. Not angle. Arc it into the corner right. And Kyle Busch is coming closer. Two laps to go for the end of stage one. Just got to work the throttle. Keep it from coming around. And Kyle's closing in. Oh, here he comes. Gonna have one more lap to hold Kyle Busch off to see if we can win stage one. Oh, as we make contact with the wall hard. I think we just choked away the stage. I'm gonna try it. No, we're not gonna have enough time. There's no way. Oh, I'm gonna go for it. Ah, uh, nope. We got really loose. Try not to wreck it. Uh, as we get into the wall there. Gonna finish third in stage one. Man, I choked that one away. That was like what uh, Tyler Reddick did in the Xfinity race. I just watched that now. Alright, but we can take half a can less of fuel, so should be good there. <coughs> and we'll stay third. Green flags out. It's Brad side drafts us a little bit. Got a little bit tight. Drifting up the track. Trying to block Kevin Harvick. And trying to keep it off of Logano. Or not Logano. Kozlowski. And we don't. As we get into the wall. Gonna try and get it back up on the track. And that was a bad idea. Oh my gosh. Oh, well, caution's back out. Uh, how many left in the stage? No, there'd be no point in pitting. Alright. <coughs> it's a good thing I don't have damage on, because I'd be furious right now. And that's exactly why I don't have it on. Alright. Move it, Bowman. Oh my gosh. And to the outside of Alex Bowman. So we get a big burst of speed in the middle of the corner. Oh, we got a little bit loose there. We held on to it. There's Kurt Busch. He's back up in the mix. As we hit Keselowski a little bit on accident, is he going to spin it? Oh, and Keselowski around. Caution's out. All right, P4 on the restart. Gonna try and give Logano a push, but he blocks us. And now we're falling back from that. Gonna try and get back in line. That was a dirty move to me on Jones, but we're trying to get ourselves advanced to Homestead. And Eric Jones didn't. Yeah, he's outside the bubble. Or no, he got eliminated a while ago. Get loose on. Turn four, exit of turn four, which is bad. We're fighting our way back up through the field. So we give Kurt a little push. The Bush brothers out front as Kurt Bush almost spins it out. And that holds us up. Oh, as we go around again, no, we're gonna save it. Car there on the 
as we're in the wall and everybody's passing us. And now Austin Dillon wrecks us. Caution's out. Alright, well my stuff is really old, so I'm gonna go ahead and pit. My man Joey Gates is right behind me, 29th now. He, I'm 28th. See if four tires can make a difference. Got six laps to see if we can at least try and finish in the top ten. And we have a whole bunch of speed now with these four fresh Goodyear tires. Boyer's all the way back in 19th. Oh, pushing Blaney a whole bunch. Uh, we have to stay on the outside. Working our way through the field. There's Kozlowski. Oh, we accidentally make contact with him. As we try to keep it out of the wall, but we can't. And we're just hitting everybody today. Oh my gosh. Still there? You got room. Good clear there. All right. Got a lot of speed here. How many laps to go in the stage? We have about like three laps, two, three laps. I don't know. I wasn't paying attention whenever it told me. All right, Kevin Harvick is the first car in the top 10. And stage two is finished as a caution came out. We were 11th, so no points for us. That's not good. But now, we can only pit for that. Try and gain some track position. We won't, but we don't lose any, which is the key. to get a good restart here and gain some track position. Oh, as Ryan Newman gets to our inside. As he tries to push us into Bowman. And now we're behind Truex and Jones. We're going to take it three wide. Oh my gosh, there we go. Three wide again for, what's this, fourth? Oh, as Jones gives us a tap, that's probably his payback for what we did to him earlier. Gave him a little tap back. Underneath Kurt Busch. Gonna try to get underneath Hamlin. We just give him a big push instead. Thirty-nine laps to go to finish the race. So we drive it in deep into turns one and two. Gonna have to back out the throttle so I don't hit the wall. We are second right now. This is the hardest race I think I've done in this series so far. Oh, we got a little bit loose there. As we get a big run heading into turn one, I have to back out just a little bit. Oh my gosh. And Kyle Busch goes up past us again. I 
Give Kyle a little tap there. And, oh. Gave him another tap. He almost spun it out there, but he saved it. Giving Kyle a whole bunch of taps, letting him know we're there. Fall back a little bit. Trying not to wreck him, just giving him a few taps. As he leaves the bottom open, and here we come. Trying to keep it off of Kyle Bush. Best I can. And here we go to the lead. And there we go. We are now the leader here at Texas. Gonna take the high side. That was a bad idea, but I think we can still make it work as we get a nice, decent run out of the corner. Kyle Bush is right behind us. Oh, I almost spun it out there. I hit the apron just a little bit. If I didn't time that perfectly, I would have spun it out. There's Kyle still behind us. Drive it in deep into turn three. There we go. All clear. Try the high side in turns three and four. Gonna drive it back down to the bottom. <coughs> Kyle's still there. Can make a move at any point. You gotta stay on top of it. It's falling back a little bit. Oh, almost make contact with the walls. We almost spin it out. We got loose coming off of turn two. Cowbush is back on our back bumper as we get a little bit loose there. Gonna have to pit in a few laps. Tires are really wearing out. Green flag pit stops might cost me. We get really tight right there. We're able to hold on to it. Right, gonna have to pit in a few laps from now. Where does the fuel run out? That is the question. So we're pulling away from Kyle Bush now. Which is good because we need a big gap because I have a feeling I'm going to mess it up on pit road. Alright, so since it runs out entering turn 3, I'm just going to keep going until I run out. Because by the time I run out, I'll be getting a pit road, so that's fine. Oh, car around. Who is it? It's either Austin Dillon or Daniel Hemrick. I think it was Hemrick. No caution for some reason. That is surprising, as I almost hit the apron there. Oh, we get in the wall hard. Here comes Kyle Bush again. He might be pitting this time by. Yeah, I think he's pitting this time. He might not, though. Oh, there he goes. We'll come in this time by. the running order right now oh wow we're tight yep we're gonna need to take four fresh tires oh 
Oh, come on. Back down, back down. All right. That should all be good the way we want it. And now we just wait to make our stop. I mean, Joey Gase was over there on pit road. And yeah, I'm pretty sure that was Daniel Hemrick who spun around, but we're getting held up on pit road by all these cars coming to pit. That could cost us. <coughs> Pit stop's gonna take 15.8 seconds. That's pretty long. Oh, the caution came out as we just pit. All right, this is gonna shake things up. Actually, not that much, actually, now that I think about it. But, okay. All right, so we have really fresh tires now. Green flags back in the air. I don't think we'll have to worry about fueling more. Well, actually, we will. We'll have to make one more pit stop. But for now, we are the leader. Here comes Kyle. He can't get there. Now Logano's looking. We sail it off into turns three and four. Twenty-three laps to go. Oh, we get in the grass a little bit. And we're good. All right. Looks like we have the best car right now. Because Kyle just can't pass us at all. Alright, 22 laps to go. So we get a little tight, but that should be fine. On board with the hood cam. Get real close to the apron. So we drift the track just a little bit. Now let's go inside the car because we have a 1.7 second lead. Oh, we get loose. And we save it, just a little bit of contact with the wall, nothing too serious. Alright, I'm not going to do that again as we get loose again. Here come second and third, but they're fighting for position as well. Joey Logano looking to the inside of Kyle Busch, but he won't get there. I forgot we got really loose off of turn four. That almost cost us. Oh, we make a little bit of contact with the walls. We get loose now, but we'll save it. Oh, we make contact with Legato now. We have eight laps of fuel as our tires should be even more worn than they were before because of this. Now we have to go track them down again. Try and... Oh man, but our car is really tight now. Ooh. Yeah, this is not good. I'll get into turn three pretty good. Now we're on the outside. Oh, we make contact with Logano now. So we'll get to the inside of Logano now. 
Got a big run on Kyle now. To the inside. Are we there? Yes, we are. Heading into turn three for the lead. We're going to clear Kyle Busch. <coughs> 16 laps to go. We're going to have to pit with around 10 laps to go. Unless the caution comes out with 14 to go. Because after that we can make it. We still run out in turn three. So we make some more contact with the wall. Logano's looking for second. 14 to go. If the caution were to come out now, we can make it. Fuel windows open. So we get really tight in turn two. And I think Logano's going to get second now. Yes, he will, but will Kyle get him back? It doesn't look like it. it looks like Logano is going to be our main threat for the win. So I think he's starting to pull away from Kyle. Have to get out the gas a lot now. Compared to when we had four fresh tires. Should be pitting soon. Oh, we hit the wall. 12 laps to go, and the caution comes out. We're going to have to pit here. Take half a can. Four fresh tires. And that should be good. Oh, some people stood out or they took no tires or just two. We're back to 10th. Green flags back out. I think we have like 10 laps to go now. Nine laps to go. All right, so we're going to have to make some big moves here if we're going to try and go for the win as we make some contact with Clint Boyer. We'll fall back to 14th. Look at Joey Gase up in 15th. Good job. Alright. We're really fast in turns 3 and 4 as we get 11th now. And we're going to easily pass Jimmy and Newman. Go to the high side here. Almost hit Denny Hamlin. 3 wide for, what's this, 6th? Seventh. Oh, Hamlin around. Caution's out. <coughs> We're going to have a few laps left here. We're seventh. I think that's Kyle Busch in first. Green flag's back out. Five laps to go. As we get fourth, there's Kurt Busch above us, and we're going to try to get underneath Truex. We won't get there yet. We'll barely clear Kurt Busch for third. So we get a big run in turn three for second. And now we are second behind Kyle Busch. How many laps? Four laps to go. We're all over the back bumper. Oh, he drifts up the track a little bit, but so did we. Literally on his bumper. Stay low, stay low. Careful, go back. We can't get around him yet. 
Oh, we get a little bit loose. They're still in it. Kyle Bush got loose too. Three to go. Oh, we make contact with Kyle Bush in turn one. He almost spins it. And can we get to him yet? No, we can't. I'm going to try to go around him on the high side in turn three. But we're not going to be able to as we make contact when we wreck. Caution's out. We're still second. And Clint Boyd just demolished us right there. And now we get... Okay. All right, we're second on the restart. <laughs> we're in NASCAR overtime. Green flags back out. Two to go. We'll fall back to third here. And we'll get second again because we get a draft off of Kyle Busch. And we'll get to his back bumper in turn three. We are right behind him. One lap to go. Oh, as Kyle Busch pushes us up the track. No! And we're wrecking. Everyone's wrecking. Caution is out. Where'd we finish? 12th. After all that. Oh my gosh. Let's get a replay of that. What happened? So right here, one lap to go. Tried to go around. Okay, wait, that's a bad angle. Um, let me change camera angles here. Alright, we'll use the top view. So we try to go around Kyle Busch. Hit his left rear, or right rear, and then we go around and come down on Joey Logano and we all start wrecking. Dang it. I think Kyle Busch has now advanced himself to the final four. <coughs> ISM is next. Joey Gase finished the 16th. Good job. Chase Elliott, 28th. Whole bunch of championship contenders finished bad. Kyle Busch wins. Truex second. In the standings right now, Kyle and Kurt Busch are advanced to the f final four. We only have one more race left to see who will make it. Uh, I have a 68-point buffer to fourth which is Chase Elliott he's still in this as long as Chase doesn't finish 40th he should be fine like if he finishes 19th or better he'll make it but if Truex, Boyer, Kevin Harvick or Denny Hamlin win I'll knock Chase out and put one of them in I think we're pretty much fine like we're pretty much advanced on points but just in case, we need to still try and go for a win at ISM. Fastest lap of the race was set by myself. Most laps led was by Kyle Busch. On the move, Jimmy Johnson started 40th, finished 6th. Tough break, Palmenard started 5th and finished 33rd. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, I forgot to get a thumbnail. Dang it. Oh, I'll just use whatever I had when I was doing that replay of what happened on the last lap. Alright. ISM next, then Homestead, then we'll wrap up this series. It's been a pretty good one so far. It's probably one of the funnest races so far. And yeah, if you guys enjoyed, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Stay super, and goodbye. See you guys later.